Are they actually half inch? No way. I'm a genius. One, two, three, four, five, six. One. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This is just absolutely not a good time. What? What's the plan? Am I going to be able to balance this like a pizza? Like a oh! oh, the sneak attack. Oh! How dare you? It's moment of truth time now. Well, by that and the title, pretty sure you can imagine what we're doing today. You can obviously see why I want to do this. Obvious reason. 17 gallons overflow. So everything that I've read online says four and a half or five quarts when you're just taking the pan off, like not taking the whole transmission apart. And somewhere on this box, service fill five quarts. I actually bought fancy stuff instead of just getting O'Reilly's cheapest, you know, because figured might as well. And there's quart number five. Yes, I know it's only 24 fluid ounces, not 32. Don't remember asking. Yeah, so this is going to be very interesting because one of the bolts on my transmission oil pan is completely stripped. Not like the head of the bolt, but the threads. I'm pretty much just hoping that it's going to come out and... Probably just not gonna put it back in because it's not doing anything anyway. A lot of y'all are probably wondering why I haven't just checked my transmission fluid before. When I got it, the transmission fluid was serviced. So, you know, just never really look at it. Till transmission's been acting weird recently, sometimes it'll just randomly like go into gear, you know, it doesn't just bang shift, you know. Normally she just smacks into gear. Like smacks into gear so hard that it chirps the tires shifting to second if you floor it. I'm kind of just hoping that this is gonna fit under my trunk. You wanna talk about like a glove, holy cow. I mean, you can't get a much better fit than that, son. I forgot to get tools. And also just for the record, I have never changed transmission fluid before. Never taken transmission oil pan off. So it's gonna be a learning experience together. Oh yeah, boy. Oh, D won't sit. Well, that's about the best angle I can get for y'all. Do I know what size the pan bolts are? No, not a clue. Gonna go with half inch first. Are they actually half inch? No way. I'm a genius. I still don't understand how this is gonna. Uh, I, what am I? I don't know what is gonna happen. I don't know where my body is gonna go. I don't know anything, as a matter of fact. So, as soon as I do this, I'm gonna get soaked in transmission fluid. This bolt right here, hopefully you can see it, completely stripped. You see, I can just literally spin it with my fingers, you know? And no, that's not for me. How am I gonna get that out? You're probably asking. I literally don't know. I think I need to put y'all on the other side. Don't I have RTV? I feel like I'm probably gonna need that. Dilate grease. Oh, yes, sir. I wasn't recording. And bad things started happening. Wish you could have seen my reaction, but you know. Sometimes people forget to hit the record button. Definitely was not me. But yeah, here, here's where we're at, okay? I really want to let this just drain forever because I don't feel like getting soaked in transmission fluid, you know? Well, I guess I'm going back in. Come on now. I can't see, dude. I can't see, you can't see. See if I can hit her with the reach around. Ow, oh, that's hot. Nope, that one's just magically tight again somehow. Now, oh, we have an angle of attack. Okay. 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 Now, I can't see these at all. Ow, oh, that's hot. How was that tight, dude? What? It's not anymore. All right, how? Oh, man. This is just not good, dude. I can't find another bolt, dog. <sighs> Don't worry about me. I'm having an awesome time. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is just absolutely not a good time. <sighs> Maybe if I scooch. Ah, I just smacked my head on the ground. Uh oh, that made the front of the pan. Oh no, I'm f I'm screwed. Now it's leaking from the front of the pan. 
maybe let me hang on a minute I almost just grabbed the exhaust that would have been not fun nice it's dripping oh, gosh dude. I, I just don't know what to do oh, this is so hot I really don't feel like taking this all the way off right now and just getting fluid everywhere, even though fluid's kind of already just everywhere, you know? I think I'm just gonna take a nap. We're coming back in, baby. Round two, son. What? Dude! This is just so bad. Oh no. Oh no, now the pan's moving. <gasps> I need to get on the other side, but I don't want to roll around in transmission fluid. I mean, I guess I'm already committed at this point. How is that tight? I think transmission fluid just dripped in my ear. Mm. What is that? Where did that come from? I just found a tiny washer. I'm completely fine with just laying here until this is not dripping anymore. Uh-oh. Things are happening. This is about to cause some commotion in the ocean. If you know what I'm saying. Oh yeah, the pan's coming down. The pan's coming down. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah! The pan is on its way back down to earth. I need to get the bottom bolts out first, dude. Okay, we're just... We're full commit. Where is my ratchet? I'm gonna take a nap right here. Oh, one bolt out. Two bolts out, three bolts, four bolts, five bolts. Why is it so hot right here, dude? Hopefully transmission fluid is good for poison ivy because I have poison ivy all over my hands and arms right now from work. So that would be nice. I think that's number six. Uh-oh, things are happening. Seven bolts. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Let me jostle that around a little bit more. I like that idea. Oh! Bad idea. That was, I mean, it, it kind of worked, so I guess it wasn't too bad of an idea. Seven bolts? One, two, three, four, five, six. One, whoa, whoa, whoa. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Number eight. Now, okay, this one. And it's the one that just tightens every two seconds. Finally, holy crap. Nine. Oh. I don't like this at all, bro. Number 10. And now that one's tight. What on God's green earth? Oh no. <laughs> She's got some motion going on now. What's all that movement back there? The strip bolt just fell out. Yeah, it's it's the transmission that stripped, not this bolt. Yay. So what is that? Number 11, I think. There is one more right there. You mother f Oh! Not good things are happening. Oh my goodness. Number 12, 14 15. No, I definitely miscounted. Oh my god. Uh-oh. 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 Oh no. 
Oh, 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 oh. That scraping sound does not sound good, but you know. Oh my gosh. Okay. What? What's the plan? Am I going to be able to balance this like a pizza? Like a oh my gosh. Well, most of the fluid should be out at this point. <laughs> That's a good thing, <laughs> at least. Okay, what is the game plan? Ha! Just keep on draining. That's fine with me. I don't know what the pan is scraping on, but we're just gonna pretend that it's fine. Okay, I guess we're here. One, two, three, four. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Yeah, definitely miscounted somewhere. I mean, understandably so with all this chaos going on, you know? Don't let it hang. You're going to bend the pan. It's not going to see right and it's going to leak everywhere. I agree with you, but there's not really an option. I really hope this doesn't fall off and smack me in the face. I was about to cuss, but didn't. Okay, there's one bolt, ladies and gentlemen. One bolt holding this on, and my serving waitress hand. Oh, I, it, it's getting hot. I need a break, or I just need to speed up. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, the sneak attack. Yes, please. I didn't buy any brake clean. I just realized to clean the pan. It's fine. Okay, the pan's off, ladies and gentlemen. What's about to happen? I don't know. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Okay, things are definitely officially happening. It actually looks really clean, though. Not gonna lie. What is that? Oh, that's the filter, I think. Okay. Okay, now what's my game plan? Huh? Huh? Oh! How dare you! Oh, my gosh. Okay. Okay. Wow, what an experience that was. There is a lot of metal on the magnet, okay? Wow, this is hot. Wow. What? Oh, no. Okay, I'm just putting that in. Wow. So, yeah, now we have problems. Just like I thought, the little O-ring thing that's on this didn't come out with it and I don't know how I'm gonna get it out uh I might not be for a guy that doesn't know what he's looking at everything looks pretty good to me how am I gonna get that out dude I think I'm just gonna think we're just gonna not like I said you know my OCD is telling me I need to get it out but I seriously don't think that I can I think I'm not taking it out I mean it doesn't look bad it doesn't look dry rotted or anything doesn't feel dry rotted. So I think we're just, yeah. Now I gotta go get the new stuff that I, for some reason, didn't bring down here. So here is what we're looking at, ladies and gentlemen, inside a 4L60E. If you've never seen it, now you have, just like me. Right here is where the filter goes in and that little O-ring thing goes in right there. So I think I'm just gonna push the new filter in. Obviously, that's the old one. I'm just using it as an example. I think I'm just gonna push it in there and see if it stays. And if it stays, then we're definitely just gonna call that a day. I need to clean the pan out though. I'm gonna try and dump the pan out so we can both see it at the same time, you know? It's really not bad. Not even gonna lie. And there's quite a bit on the magnet, but that's the magnet. About to go just get some paper towels and go to town, I guess. Paper towel POV. Yeah, I definitely need brake clean. Actually just cleaned up pretty dang good son think I'm gonna call that good enough right there this is the little o-ring thing I'm talking about that is impossible to get out so I guess I'm just gonna keep it keep it in there <laughs> yeah 
I don't know how I'm gonna get this wrinkly freaking gasket on there. I'm just gonna try and get the filter on first. I definitely don't feel like that's on. Hmm. Oh, she's going on now. Hang on a second. I think that's actually on. Mm. I think that's on, dude. I actually think it is. I don't know how I'm going to get this gasket on. No way this is actually going to work. I'm just sticking the bolts through the... I, I'll show you. This is going to take so long, dude. Where did that bolt just go? This little magic trick I'm doing is actually working good. Yeah, all I did is just stick all the bolts through and give them a little twist like you're tightening. And it like pulled the gasket down. I don't really know how to explain it. If you're doing this, you know what I'm talking about. Like when you stick the bolt through the pan and through the gasket, like the gasket catches on the threads. So like the gasket's up here instead of like down on the pan. So you just twist the bolts and it sucks the gasket down. Ah, uh, yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, carefully. Bingo, bango. Why does that not look good? I mean, it it's holding itself. That's not lined up, but I can't see, so. Okay, why why is this not lining up, son? I don't want to lay in this transmission fluid dog. Okay, that one finally bit into something. Okay, cool. Oh, I think she's lined up now, boy. Oh, yeah, yes, sir. Freaking school bus going by. Ruined my audio. Uh, is this stripped? It's just spinning forever. What on planet Earth? Okay, so why is this just spinning forever? Maybe the bolt is stripped. Maybe I... Let me, let me look at this bolt. Wait, I'm actually going to leave that in for now? because it's holding the gasket in place. I didn't think that through. Hopefully the gasket didn't just mess up right then, dog. But let me just, this is the one that was stripped. Let me see if it's still stripped. Yeah, this one's still stripped. Okay, so I I don't know about that one. That one was tight, so. Why does that look cross-threaded? Shut up. Well, I guess I gotta lay on the trans fluid. I mean, I already kinda am anyway, so. Full commit or no commit. I'm trying to tighten them kinda evenly, you know? There's just a lot of silence right now. My brain's on overdrive. That is definitely cross-threaded. Why does that look like that? Huh? Maybe it's not. It is now if it is, son. My ratchet's on loosen, dog. There ain't no way. How? I hope the gasket's not freaked. Let me take it out again and look, I guess, because I already f***ed. No, I don't think it messed up, actually. Cool. Oh my gosh, this sucks, dude. My hand is starting to cramp from how many times I've been finger tightening, finger untightening. Oh, that does not feel good. That's way cross-threaded. Dude, no, no. Oh yeah, we, oh, I saved it, dude. I saved it. Oh, that was almost bad. The sun's starting to come out. Too bad I'm under my truck right now. 
Yeah, that bolt that's stripped, or the threads that are stripped for the bolt, I think I'm just going to leave it in there for moral support, you know? You know, body positivity, we're just going to leave it in there for bolt positivity. Ooh, why is that that time? Full send. And there goes my hat. Dude, I am so over this. We're close, ladies and gentlemen. We're close. If I hit my exhaust one more time, dude, sounds like I'm in a sounds like I'm in a playground. Here I am tightening the strip bolt. If this leaks, I'm selling the truck. Two grand OBO, Mr. Young, it's yours if this leaks. Actually, 2100 because I basically just spent $100 on it. So, you know, you got to pay for it. You're supposed to tighten the start pattern. I actually will just to make you all happy, okay? <clears throat> yep. Yep. Mm-hmm. That's the stripped one, so it just messed up the star pattern. Did I do that one? Yeah. Okay. Obviously, do not tighten these tight, okay? Tie them tight, but not tight, if you know what I'm saying. I don't remember which one I'm on, dude. How is that one that loose? Oh, dude. The ratchet just broke almost. I need a break, dude. I am so sore from yesterday. We did 16 yards of mulch yesterday. <sighs> Didn't even finish the job either. So that means these are just going to loosen up, right? A little bit, yeah. Holy bazooka. I almost rather just pay somebody to do this for me. No joke, dude. This is freaking terrible. That's the stripped bolt, Wesley. Holy cow. That felt like it was about to strip, son. <laughs> I'm about to just be done. I'm definitely not touching that one anymore. It feels really sketch. Okay, I, I'm, I'm calling that done. Actually, I'm not. That's the stripped bolt. I wish I could say I was joking about how many times I've tried to tighten that strip bolt. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, that one actually was kind of loose. I'm done, son. I lied, I'm not. Now I'm done. <sighs> Don't buy these, they suck. Ready for a nap, dude. I need you. Stick you in Nile. Proud to be an American. You're dang right, bull. Mm-hmm. Uh-oh, that was almost bad, son. Okay, that's enough for now. So what you want to do, since this is literally thicker than my ex-girlfriend, you want to... Empty this enough to where you can put this in there, shake it around a little bit, you know, so it's all mixed good, and then pour the rest of it in. That's an old vice grip garage tip. I mean, look at that, dog. Look at that. Are you looking? Oh, problems are arising. Okay, that's good for now, son. Then you put your cap back on, you know, give, them, give it some of these numbers. Oh, yeah. And then you're going to give her the rest. Straight on the manifold. Heck yeah. Oh, I thought I could just dump the rest really fast. No. Now she's empty, boo. Kind of looks like it's about to storm. Okay. Oh, yeah. That's good, son. That is good for me. Oh, man. It's moment of truth time now. Didn't even use the RTV. Hopefully that's fine. I'm scared to put it in gear. Oh, she shifted straight into gear. Oh. Oh. Oh, yeah, boy. Well, I'm going to let her mix up for a minute, you know. Give her a little cruise and check the level and start cleaning this up don't worry about that yeah you're seeing that right six literally like the best thing i've ever eaten in my life i swear dude oh, oh god so good transmission i haven't checked the fluid level. haven't checked the fluid level yet but 
are shifting nice. Well, guess let's check the fluid. No bubbles. Let's go, dude. Might still be a little bit over full, but really don't care because it's not so full that there's bubbles in it. So, huh, consider that a massive success, son. On that note, ladies and gentlemen, that is the end of the video. Hopefully you learned something. Hopefully you learned something not to do. Hopefully you got a little chuckle out of it, at least, if you didn't learn anything. But hopefully I'll see y'all on the next new video next Monday. New video every single Monday. New video. Absolutely love y'all so freaking much, as I always say. Sound like a broken record, but I mean it. This is Word, and I am gone, son. Peace. Mm, you smell good.